So what else I would do in the meantime, I will open this tofu and chop it in small cubes. Okay, so let's open it. maybe I will take only half of it it's too much okay so let's check how soup is doing so as you can see it's boiling this smells so nice okay and our tofu is also ready so we are going to add this tofu to our soup Okay, so now I have added this soft tofu in our soup. It looks so good. So now we will let it boil again. Okay, and in the meantime, we will prepare for miso. So we are going to take one sachet of this miso and whisk it properly so this is how it looks like if you can see that okay so I'm going to take it and whisk it with this soup spoon if you have better instrument or better equipment for whisking you can use that one I don't so I will use this soup spoon okay so how I'm gonna do that I have already cut this packet or sachet now I will whisk it with a with little amount of water okay so I will add small amount of water I think this much is enough okay and whisk it properly So 
this soup already has some seaweed in it. So if you want to add more, you can add more. I had some fresh ferns, so I added some fresh ones. Fresh seaweed leaves. Okay, I think it is ready. Or if you want, you can add more water, like I'm doing. And now it's ready. So we will add this one. We will add this to our soup, to our boiling soup. So like this. Okay, so now we will boil it for some more time. Maybe for another three, four minutes. Okay, so now it's boiling and uh, I hope it's ready. So let's check it out if it is ready or not. Like you can see, it's ready and it smells very, very good. Okay, so let's switch off this burner. Now this hob, right? Very good. So now it's ready to serve and uh, I will show you how I'm going to serve it. Okay, so now this miso soup, tofu miso soup is ready. And it's very delicious and it smells so good. So, if you like this recipe, please like it. If you don't like this recipe, please dislike it. And in the comment section, let me know how do you feel about this recipe. If you make this recipe at home, please share your experience with us. Thank you so much.